Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to work with the type tools in Adobe Photoshop CC. Um, there's a set of four type tools in Adobe Photoshop. Uh, we're going to start with the first one on the top, horizontal type tool. As the na name says, um, it allows you to type horizontally. As soon as you select the type tool, take a look at the options bar. Here you can change the font face, font type, font size and alignment, font color. Um, I'm going to choose Arial, black, font size, I'm going to go for 150 points, um, alignment to the left, and for color I'm going to click here and choose perhaps color white there you go now you can click anywhere in the uh, document and start typing all right and I can go back to move tool and move this around and as simple as it is anytime you want to make modifications to it you can go back to the type tool again and highlight and make some modification I can for instance I can highlight the whole thing change the font size I'm going to type 100 so it makes it a bit smaller and then you can go here change the color as well there you go um, anytime you type anything on a document it will create a layer for it you can work with the layer as you would with any layer you can make it invisible or you can drag it to the garbage bin to get rid of it there you go uh, let's take a look at the, look at the uh, second type tool, vertical type tool. Vertical type tool allows you to type vertically. So I'm going to click here and type the same thing. Yeah, you see the result is completely different. Um, there's some questions of legibility uh, and since we read English from top left to right it's very difficult to read it vertically so I would say this is perhaps not a good choice for um, languages like English and it might be useful for some other languages some Asian languages uh, right from top to bottom so um, let's take a look at let's get rid of this one I'm going to bring it to the garbage bin let's take a look at the third item uh, the third item is vertical type mask tool I'm going to um, show you one example for both because they both do the same thing so we got vertical and horizontal type mask I'm gonna go for the hor um, horizontal version because it's easier to show um, and to type in English I'm gonna go for a font size uh, 150 again so this time when you start typing it actually types over a red mask um, and shows you what you see through the text because that's what you're gonna get as soon as you switch to any other tool for instance I'm gonna to switch to the move tool you see this um, turns to a selection you can use the selection to um, create a new layer I'm going to copy this so press Control C or command C for Mac and then you can deselect this selection go to select deselect now I'm going to paste um, the selected or copied selected area so there you have it and uh, that could be interesting you could use it anywhere and it looks like a clipping mask so there you have it um, type tools in Adobe Photoshop uh, there will be more videos to show you how to modify text and using character and paragraph panels but for the moment enjoy the video thank you for watching